What's up guys? Greg Ha with Island Collectibles here. Today I'm going to go over the books that I'm going to be submitting to CGC today. First, I'm going to show you them. I'm going to tell you what I think the approximate grade is. And then I'm going to follow it up with a video when I get these books back. So it's probably going to be a couple months. But I'll follow it up with a video showing what the grades actually were. Let's see how close or how far away I get. First up, we have a near mint copy of Fugitoid number one. This is the second appearance of Fugitoid. And I have this one graded at a near mint. I think this is going to grade at a 9.6. Second up, I have this Golden Age copy of Superman 12. It is a World War II cover and pretty neat. Just a closer look. Beautiful. Now, I should mention all these books were pressed by my buddy at Spineworks Comics. Check out Lenny at Spineworks Comics if you'd like to get your books pressed and cleaned. Now for grade, this book does have some foxing around the edges, which Lenny was able to clean a little bit, but it still has some staining left behind. I think this book's going to grade at a 3.5. Next up, we have this copy of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number one. This is actually the second print, which is a little bit more sought after. There's about 7,000 of these floating around, or there was 7,000 printed. So this book was also pressed and clean. It does have multiple color breaking creases in it. I think this book's going to grade at a 5.0. Next up, we have this giant size X-Men number one. This book was also pressed and cleaned. It does have a tear up the spine that goes about an inch up, and it also has a little bit of a color rub here on the front on Colossus's leg. Otherwise, a decent copy. You can tell it was a reader copy, though. I have this graded at a 2.5. Next, we have Archie's Joke Book, number one. This is a 10 cent Golden Age copy of an early Archie book. This one was pressed and clean, but it shows a lot of fading and deterioration. I think this book is also going to grade at a 2.5. Next up, we have Bone Number One, Second Print. This is an awesome book. What an underrated uh, run this is. This run was done by Jeff Smith, and this is a book that actually is pretty highly sought after now, especially Bone Number One, First Print. That book has seen big jumps in price, and as it should, it really should, because it is such a cool... Uh, series. This book, also pressed and cleaned, I think is going to grade out at about a 7.5. Here we have Superman's girlfriend, Lois Lane. This is the first Silver Age appearance of Catwoman, as you can see here on the cover. Now, this book does have some rusting at the staples, which is unfortunately gotten through to the book, and there's really no way to clean that up without removing the staples and cleaning them. But if you do that, then the book is considered restored. I had Lenny clean it up as well as he could, and it looks much better than it did when it went in. I have this book at about a 1.8, 2.0. In the last book from this submission, I have this Batman 155, first Silver Age appearance of Penguin. Also, somebody said first appearance of Charizard. Maybe it is. Pretty nice book overall. Staples are good. Book's complete. I'd put this one about a 4.0. Well, there you have it. There's my newest submission to CGC. I'm going to upload this video now, and then I'll look back in a couple months and do a follow-up video when I get these books back. I'll tie it all in together, and I'll make one big, long, epic video. Thank you guys so much for following. Please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell if you haven't already so you can get updates anytime I go live or have a new video come out. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Buy comics, have fun, and we will see you soon. See you guys.